So there are multiple data challenges when it comes to managing non-communicable diseases in humanitarian settings. The first is related to prevalence. So in many settings, we know very little about what the baseline prevalence is of the key cardiovascular, diabetes, cancer, and chronic respiratory diseases responsible for most mortality globally. We don't know the numbers officially that are affecting these populations that are affected by crisis. Um, in some settings, we have co you know, clinic-based studies or household surveys where people have been asked to self-report on their disease diseases um, or else we might have a study done on a specific hospital population but we don't know at the at the broader population level what the prevalence of these diseases is and that data is important in planning a response and then the second major gap is in terms of models of care so there's very little research evidence um, or programmatic guidance about how humanitarian actors or host country systems should respond to the non-communicable disease crisis in, in refugees or internally displaced, po displaced populations. So what are the ideal models of care? Who should be delivering it? In, in what setting? Um, and who should receive it? Should screening be involved? Etc. So those are the two major gaps from my perspective.